Administration and Finance Committee will come to order. Our first order of business is item 19, a salary ordinance for Code Enforcement Department and Department Head Recruitment. Motion to approve. Second. We have a motion and a second. Any discussion? All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? The ayes have it. Item 20, resolution to amend the city's fee schedule by adding recycling cart pricing and waiver fee for curbside alley edge garbage and recycling collection to the public works fee session section. Move, move, for, for, move for approval. Second. A motion and a second. Any discussion? Yeah, I just wanted to clarify. Um, so I, I pulled it up and I seen obviously adding the recycling carts and that makes sense to be amended as needed when prices go up. <clears throat> I was just confused on was the waiver fee is what was added that if it's deemed that they're fully disabled, DPW automatically waives the fee or is it case by case basis that gives them the option to waive it if needed? Dave? Thank you, Mr. Chair. So yeah. what, this is a program that for those patrons that have a, are physically unable, uh, they would apply and they would be assessed a $100 fee. Mm -hmm. And then they would have to be certified that they're medically unable to place a refuse or recycling cart at the location of a curb or a alley uh, mm -hmm. edge. By them certifying that they and anybody that's a resident within that dwelling is also medically uh, unable, then we would collect the recycling ref uh, refuse container at the residence, mm -hmm. usually in the back or by the front door. And then this is so that you can waive that fee or charge that fee? Charge that fee. Oh, okay, I get it. Thank this you. has been ongoing, Dave, yeah. since we yeah, please, started please. curbside collection, yeah. right? Well, I, been a while. Since, yeah. since forever. Yeah, yeah it's been a while since we did this. For a long time. It's yeah. for, for elderly that can't get the, yeah. you know, think of the curb. Makes sense. So I did survey eight communities, you know, that do still uh, collect on their own. Uh, the city of Dallas and the city of Milwaukee are the only communities that offer this program. Yeah. Alderman Weigel. The half hour ago we're talking about automated, of the potential going to automated garbage. How would this interface with that? Do we have, and do we have, how many of these waivers do we have? How many people in this position? So currently we have about 30 to 40 yeah. residential dwellings that have identified with uh, medically. Because that number's gonna go up as, as baby boomers get less able. Potentially, <laughs> correct. <laughs> and your question, uh, automated, <coughs> that collection, but that driver would have to yep, roll that container down and uh, to the location where that rapid rate of blood rate is attacking. Yep. You have that. Oh, for the big. The flower problem. The flower, yeah, that's yeah. a good term for them. Yeah, I remember those two <laughs> big round dumpsters mm -hmm. for commercial units when we yep. picked up apartments. And, and taverns. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right, we have a motion and a second. Any further discussion? All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? The ayes have it. Item 21 is a resolution approving a, a two-year extension of the amendment to the Intergovernmental Emergency Medical Services Agreement for the Emergency Medical Service EMS between Milwaukee County and the City of West Dallas for 2021 to 2025. Move for oh, approval. Second. We have a motion and a second, and the one thing I want to report, and Mason can tell us more about it if necessary, is that we're getting more money out of the county. That's that's the happy thing. Oh, happy day. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Any further discussion? All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? The ayes have it. Uh, item 22 is a communication from the city administrator submitting the 2023 budget and, and capital planning calendar. Move to place on file. Second. We have a motion and a second. Any discussion? All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? The ayes have it. And item 23, communication from the city engineer uh, requesting reclassification of position of administrative support assistant to civil engineer in the engineering department. Move for approval. Second. second. We have a motion and a second. And one thing that I'll add um, is there's an, an advantage uh, in uh, having this uh, Position be a city engineer because it we the the funding can come from both the general fund and the water utility based on the work 
that this engineer does versus even uh, having an administrative support assistant where the funding must all come from the general fund. There's value there. All right, we have a motion and a second. Uh, any further discussion? All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? The ayes have it. Is there anything else that, to appropriately come before the committee? Will we adjourn? Second. All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? The ayes have it. Thank you. Safety and Development Committee will come to order. All members are present. Item 31 and the agenda's communication from the city administrator regarding code enforcement department and department head recruitment. Place on file. Move to approve and place on file or place on file with Second. our. Any discussion? All in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? Carried. Item 32 is an ordinance to rename building inspections and neighborhood services to code enforcement department and update various outdated department names. Move for approval. Second. Any discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Carried. Is there a motion to adjourn? Motion to adjourn. Second. All in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? Carried. Ah. Nice.